Bowl as the Jacksonville Indians will host the Wild White House Wildcats. So much tradition in the stadium, but tradition does not help you win games. I sat down with both coaches to talk about the game day preview. Friday night, it'll be the Wildcats versus the Indians at the legendary Tomato Bowl Stadium, where the history is respected across East Texas. Well, we're always excited to play at home. Uh, you know, I'm from here, graduated from here, and I played in the Tomato Bowl. My dad played in the Tomato Bowl. I've been here, this is going on year four for me, and uh, I've had the opportunity to play there. Uh, I want to say this will be three out of four times. Uh, it's a great place to play, and, uh, you know, it, with it being, you know, close to here, it's uh, uh, it makes everything a lot of fun. The stadium has over 75 years of history, and it's one of the last remaining downtown stadiums in Texas. But that means nothing of Jacksonville can't come away with the win at home. Whether we're playing them in the tomato bowl or in a parking lot, again, we've got to, we've got to be concerned about us and what we do and how we do it. That's got to be the focus. We're in week three of district play, so Jacksonville has some things to clean up before facing off with the Wildcats. Learning how to win, learning how to win games. Uh, we've been close in, in, in a couple. We've got one win on the season, but we've been close in a couple where we had great opportunities to win and couldn't get it done from an execution standpoint or had a turnover or something of that nature. While Jacksonville only has one win under their belt, White House only has two and they faced adversity early in the season. We lost our quarterback back in week two against Kilgore and so that was a pretty big blow to us but we've had some guys step up uh, in those roles. Uh, we've had, had had really three guys uh, that have that have kind of filled in kind of kind of a rotational deal. Both teams have little things to clean up but only one team will walk away with the win. We've got to avoid those those big momentum swing plays um, that can occur that, that really affect how you play and if we'll do that I've got every bit of confidence that we're I know that we are a competitive football team. I've got every bit of confidence that we can be successful. Uh, obviously, you want to try to win every game. Uh, you know, I feel like with, with the game plan we have set in and uh, uh, the, the key spots that we're going to get back is going to help us uh, gain some depth. Uh, we, we, we always have a good chance. Uh, and so but that's why you go play the game on Friday nights and, and see what happens. Our very own CBS 19 Under the Lights kickoff show will be on the grounds of the Tomato Bowl and you can watch the show starting at 630 and the game kickoff is scheduled for 730.